How you doing guys? Uh, Nick Reed back here with the Crossman Vantage air rifle. Uh, brake barrel. Uh, shoots about 1500 FPS. Very good for small game and uh, like raccoons, squirrels, bunnies. Uh, you name it, small, uh, I've almost, almost even killed a, like a, uh, bobcat with this thing, uh, so, very accurate, very reliable, had it for about a year now, very reliable, and, uh, just as a, works great, um, so first, very comfortable buttstock, uh, this is, this, all of this bottom right here is all wood, um, solid wood, uh, you got a kind of a recoil absorber right here, uh, just very comfortable in the shoulder, alright, um, right, let me get a little closer, All right, here's your trigger, okay. All right, here's your trigger. Um, you have the classic Crossman trigger safety. It's on fire now. Safety now, can't pull back the trigger. Very smooth trigger pull, not at first. Uh, you just have to break it in. Very smooth trigger pull. Comes with a center point four by 32 scope um comes with the scope rings um i actually just bought a gamo um shit i can't think of what it was it's a gamo scope um probably this one is very accurate to about 40 yards that gamma goes out to about 60. 60 yards, you're not killing a whole lot other than birds, squirrels, and that's about it. You're not killing like raccoons or bobcats at about 60 yards. Um, uh, but you got your scope uh, protector right here. You just put this right on there. And I, I always keep mine on it. It... I, it got dusty once, and I was just about to take my shot, and it affects it so much, it's not even funny. Um, so, how you get the scope off, all it is, all the, how you get the scope off is, right, with an allen wrench all right i'm going to take it off to show you the iron sights just like a half a maybe like one turn per screw and right off and let me see if i can show you the scope picture uh not very good so there it is center point 4 by 32 scope um very great to about 40 yards after that pretty shitty Yep. Alright. It comes with amazing iron sights. Um, okay, not amazing. But very good iron sights. Alright, so you have your, I think this windage right here. and Or no, this is your elevation right here. And 
your windage is right on the other side. I broke off the knob for it uh, so it doesn't work anymore, but I had it set perfect. But this is the one you change the most. And then you have your permanent front sight here. Uh, very nice material that it's made out of. It actually kind of glows in the dark, I think, sometimes. So let me try to show you the sight picture. That's basically it right there. Uh, sorry about this camera. It's my webcam on my school computer. Uh, found it that the best ammo is Daisy. Got to give it to them. I actually bought these. These are the Precision Max pointed uh, 177 caliber pellets. That's what this is, 177 caliber. Um, 0.177, I'm sorry. These are pointed. Um, these are great for about 40 yards and just going straight through a squirrel, but it, it, do, it doesn't really kill them right away. The ones I found that were the best were the hollow points with the like point in them, I guess. They were, I think they were also daisy. Uh, very good. They were, but I mean, I haven't really just got these yesterday actually um still got a whole bunch left but really they're great let me see if i can show you one here that's what it is right there just a pointed pellet um, works great. I mean, I'm not hating on them at all, but I mean, worked fine for me. I'm just complaining a little bit because it does not break off as much as the hollow points did in the body of the squirrel. Um, not a very loud gun. Actually, I'll shoot it right now at my window. Um, not a very loud gun. Um, but very accurate and very, uh, very packs a nice punch. Um, when you, when you hit something, if it's not going down that shot, you better believe it's going down the next shot. Um, but I am going to show you how to load this and I am just going to shoot out my window. All right. So what we're going to do. The safety is on. Doesn't have to be on, but I like both of my eyes and all my fingers, so I'm going to turn it on when I load it. All right, so you, it's about 40 pounds, so you just, once you hear the click, you stop and it'll stay. So here's what it looks like now. So, I mean, this is, it's spring, mine is spring. They came out with a new one that's gas, like, it was like, a week after I bought mine and I'm like well that's great but I mean they both work the same I think the gas one is like 200 FPS faster than mine all right you got your bolt right there and you just put your pellet in there and just make sure it's flush right against there and then you just flip it forward Alright, All right, this will show you about how loud it is. Let me open my window here. Okay. Safety off. Three, two, There's your shot. Um, wasn't really aiming for anything. It's dark out there, but yeah, neighbors probably won't like that. But it's about 
one o'clock in the morning. Uh, but very good gun. Very happy with it. Cheap. It's about 120 bucks, 130 bucks. So if you're looking for pest control on a budget, perfect gun right there. Uh, comes with a great scope, 40 yards I said. Um, not really much you could ask for on a budget. My next gun is going to be a Gamma Whisper. Um, or gam whatever. It's going to be a Gamma. Um, because I've always loved those guns. I used to have one, it broke. So, getting back with it. Um, so, like this channel, subscribe, and thank you for watching.